Hey everybody! So this morning I got up at, well actually I've been awake since 2 o'clock for some reason, I've been really excited so I tried to get back to sleep but um, I got up at around uh, 4 o'clock and I'm now at the train station heading down to Wollonga on the Seaford train. So here we go, departs in 11 minutes, I don't know if you can see that, probably not. Um, and then once I get to Seaford, a friend's picking me up, just dropping me off at Wollonga and from there I'm gonna all going well go up Wollonga Hill come back down meet a few of the other people and then we're gonna ride from Wollonga to Gawler entirely on bike paths so this is a huge adventure it's really cool because it's something that I've been thinking about for a while and I've been wanting to do and I'm, I'm so determined that we can ride that whole distance entirely on bike paths so keep watching and see how it all turns out <laughs> Okay, it's a little bit cheating, but um, my friend Darcy picked me up in the in the car and is dropping me off well, from Seaford to Wollonga so that I've got time to go up Wollonga Hill. So I'm kind of committed to doing that now. <laughs> so um, we'll see how that goes. Okay. Wearing socks and sandals. Okay, so before going from Wollonga to Gawler, I'm gonna do Wollonga Hill and do this climb. So I have done it about three or four times before. Um, you can see here there's a sign that officially marks the start of it. Um, it's you know, three kilometers, seven percent average. It takes me about 16 minutes to get up, five minutes to come down. So yeah, I'll film a little bit of it and this is a great start to the next 100 kilometers of flats up to Gawler. <laughs> Let's do this. Here we go, Wollonga Hill, yay! <laughs> So Wollonga Hill is a bit of an icon um, around here because it's used for the tour down under often so um, people always want to come and do Wollonga Hill and test themselves against uh, the king of the mountain and the queen of the mountain. Okay I'm just going to do some filming. Okay and we are ready to take off and do this. Hang on I'm going to start that again. What am I going to say? <laughs> <laughs> we <were ready. laughs> okay, here we are. We are in Wollonga and we've got Darcy, we've got Robin, <laughs> we've got John and we've got um, Tony. There we go. And we are going to ride today from here to Gawler entirely on bike paths. It's the first time that it's been done. Well, the first time that I've done it and the first time that most people have done it. So we're going to join all these bike paths and show that it can be done. Not sure if it's going to be 100 kilometers or more, hopefully a bit more. Um, Let's go! Now we're almost there, we're at the um, end of the Coast of Iron, so we'll do a little um, filming up here, but this is really cool. So we've done the, um, so hang on, vines to coast, and now we're gonna go along the coast. done the vines to coast and now we're going to head down to Merino and ride along the coast to West Beach but um, this was an awesome ride and a little bit hard as well on some of the hills so let's see what everyone has to say about it. Oh, I don't know <laughs> if I like that. Going down will be all right but not up. <laughs> you did well. That was cool. Yeah it's, it's really hilly isn't it? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. It's good for practicing your climbs and getting in your legs. Bring it on. Off to Gawler. <laughs> Oh, 
Look at that, absolutely stunning. This one's so pretty. How about this? Like we've just come from the coast and now look what we're riding through. The river and the trees. Greenway that goes all the way to Outer Harbour. There's Tony heading along. He's like, it's good riding with Tony because he makes me go faster. It's good. Nice competition. <laughs> Um, I'm going to start here. Uh, <laughs> uh, who's ordered some food? Oh, yes. Hi. Hi. Where are you from? Are you local? <laughs> yeah, we are. Oh, yeah. What? Where, where are you from? Oh, One China. From oh, there we China. go. Oh, Welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Yum. That looks good. Yum, yum. It's always perfect timing to turn that on. Yum. Uh, yeah. Alright, so we have come from Wollonga to Port Adelaide and we've decided to stop here. I think we've been riding for four hours? Mm, yeah, close to that, yeah. Four hours four and we've hours. gone like how many k? 70? Uh, 70 something, 73, 74. Yeah. Yep. Mm. It's been awesome and so we're just stopping to have some food. <laughs> Cup of tea. Feed our faces. <laughs> Cappuccino. Yum. And, um, and then we're going to connect up to the Tapa Martin the um, bike way from here and, um, and carry on to Gawler. Yes, thank there you. There go, some more food. Thank, thank you very much. Um, so, how's everyone finding it? Enjoying it? You enjoying yeah, it? Yeah, great. Yeah, we're enjoying it very much. It's great. Yeah, Perfect day. day for it. Yeah. yeah. Good day. Perfect. Yeah. Perfect weather, isn't it? Mm, yeah. yeah. Not too hot. Yeah. Not too cold. Yeah. Yeah. And it's, it's a good mixture of climb, a little bit of climbing, flats, ocean, river, city, um, this. And soon we're going to go on a little bit of barren, but you'll see that. <laughs> yeah. All right. Bye. Mm. All right. So here we are. We're back on. We've just left Port Adelaide and we're on the. Um, this is a Tapa Martinthi bikeway um, that goes all the way, you can keep following it all the way to Gawler and it goes out to Salisbury or Mawson Lakes or um, back to the city. Um, so yeah, we're just going to be on this. It's quite fun actually because it's, it's a little bit sort of... See. It's a bit um, barren and a bit desolate kind of thing, but it's a really, it's just different again. And then, um, but it's like a racetrack. <laughs> you can go really fast. And especially on a day like today, because we have a tailwind. Woo! <laughs> okay. All right, check that out. That's where we're going, Gawler on the Northern Expressway, Tapa Martinthi. Yeah! Oh, yeah. All the way up there. <laughs> All the way up there. And we're right there where that big red dot is. I don't know if you can see that. I'll zoom in on it. But um, we're here, we're gonna say bye to Robin because she's gonna go back to the city. Thanks for Bye. having me. It's been nice awesome. To nice, to, nice to be nice. with I'll, you. Uh, nice. I'll follow you on Strava okay, once we've got the, the work <laughs> done with, but yeah. 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 Oh, good. And then you we're, too, gonna, we're gonna be heading out this way. It looks really, barren it is very barren yeah yeah this is a really cool racing <laughs> bike path really there's hardly anyone out here it's really smooth and flat look at that and in a day like today where it's a tailwind you can just boom and you can race and you can get koms qoms on strava it's very very cool so we'll say bye to um to robin and then uh and we'll head the other way and i think we're still about an hour and a half away maybe in this wind maybe no it's about an hour and a half <laughs>
I think we've got a little bit lost. We've come the wrong way. We're going to go around, go back the other way. Um, we're heading towards Salisbury, so we missed a turn somewhere. So we're going to go back and uh, find the turn off to Gawler. Yay! <laughs> okay, so this looks like the turn off. Right, so I think we're. This is all new to me, this part. See the guys over there? Yep. So we're now following. So I've ridden all these bike paths up till now, so this is all brand new to me. So we'll, uh, yeah. <laughs> Well, I guess I think this is where we must ride along the freeway all the way to Gawler, maybe. Anyway, let's go. Last leg, very last leg of the journey. I think we're sitting at around 100 kilometers right now, so I think it's about another 30k. I love their outfit. These two didn't actually wear the same color clothes. They don't actually know each other until today. And um, I love the black and the red because it, it stands out really, really well. It's very cool. But yeah, apparently this is, so this road, this is our last 30K, but um, this is, uh, this path follows the, um, what was that road, this road that we're following? Uh... That's called Wakefield Road. Oh, Wakefield. Yeah. 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 Northern Expressway. Oh, Northern Expressway. Okay. Uh, so there's a Northern Expressway. So the bike path is following the Northern Expressway all the way to Gawler. Northern Connector or whatever it's called. Northern Connector. Ha! Oh, and that is it. That is done. We we just did it. Yay! Oh, we can do it. 128 uh, for me 128 kilometers um, I don't know how many hours I'll put it up after I load the video but um oh my goodness that last 10 kilometers was freaking hard because <laughs> it was like what well, like into the wind right and like yeah, yeah, in dry, some spots, dry yeah. and hard and into the into the wind um, yeah and uh, yeah that was that was uh, and, and I ended up having some gel. Um, I don't usually have, have never had a gel before, but and now my clothes are all falling off. <laughs> um, it's all the weight you've lost. <laughs> I had a gel for the first time, so thanks, thanks um, to John and uh, yeah, and Tony for um, for talking me into that. But uh, that was freaking awesome. So we'll um, so yeah, I'll uh, remember to subscribe. Um, follow on Strava, um, Instagram, Facebook, um, all the links are below um, and uh, definitely check it out on, on Strava and I highly, highly recommend doing this. It's entirely on bike paths, Wollonga to Gawler. Um, you could do it the other way around which I think would be better because you start off with the dry flat bits first along the, the freeway and then but um, yeah definitely give it a go it's, it's definitely worth it and I think from here it'll be um, doing something that goes up into the Barossa and things so uh, yeah follow along and yeah keep watching Mwah! bye and now we get a ride home <laughs>